Hey there, it's Matt Ramarina coming to you with the deadly trap for today for network marketing. Stay tuned and we're going to talk about the idea of the week. Sounds great, but how that idea of the week could totally demolish your network marketing business. Stay tuned. Okay, great. Look, idea of the week. Don't get me wrong, having ideas is a brilliant, brilliant thing. Um, And putting them down on paper, implementing them, it's a great thing. But what it can do is it can have a negative impact on your team, your downline, your whole organization and, and whole network marketing business. Okay, And you don't want that to happen because if you come up with something that then other people start running with, then everyone starts back from square one and you're starting from the beginning again. And you don't want that. You want to be able to keep a consistent way of going and building so follow the system that you have that's a proven model and have that working for you your ideas that you have implement as a supplementary extra on top of your daily method of operation which is your daily routine your daily profit producing activities okay because that way then if you find that it works you can then turn around and let others have that as again a supplementary extra um, action to do to help them build. But I would always emphasize to every downline member, if you're recruiting, doing something specific and it's working for you, stay doing that. Don't change what works. If it ain't fit, if it ain't broke, don't fix it, right? Everyone knows that saying, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. Don't go tweaking and playing with something when it works. So stick to your system that you have, follow the uplines, follow your sponsors with what they're suggesting to you to do because those systems, those processes are there for a reason, they work. Okay, so when you start playing around with them, that's when it starts getting complicated and starts causing disruption. Another big point that I want to highlight with this particular one is when you come up with different ideas every week, you confuse your members. You confuse your teammates, you confuse your downline because they're going, well, hang on a minute, last week you were saying do this, now you're saying do that? What are we doing? We all know that a confused mind doesn't take action. A confused mind won't take the do the processes and follow the system that you want them to because they're confused. No one goes down a path being confused but going ahead anyway. Everyone stops to try and work it out and when they stop, you lose motivation, you lose momentum, and then again, you've got to kickstart the business back from the beginning. So don't get me wrong, great having ideas of the week and having different things and different focuses, but just be careful how you implement them into your business because what you do, your downline will do. So you need to be highlighting the fact that, yes, you found a new way to prospect, a new way to do something or whatever it is, but you're doing it on top of your existing routine. So it's an added extra. And make sure that your team and your downline know it. Look, I hopefully you've got benefit from this. I'm going to cut this one short because I want you to go and get on. Have those ideas. Put them down on paper. Start trying them yourself over and above your existing profit-producing activities that you've got. Okay, Go make today count and go and have fun. Now, if you have found this valuable, before I forget, before I let you go, if you are finding these trainings, these deadly traps, really useful and highlighting certain aspects of the business that you didn't really think about and you want to find out more about how you can improve and develop your skills in network marketing with motivational and inspirational and skill-based trainings, then come and join our community on Facebook. I'll put a link somewhere around this video that will take you straight there. Send your request in to join the, the community. I'll accept you in, but send me a message first when you do the request so I know that you've requested. Okay, and I can look out for that request then through on the community and add you in. So go make today count and have fun. I'm glad you're getting benefits from these these deadly traps. There's seven in total. I'm not too sure what number we're on now, but there's seven in total. So if you've watched seven of these and this is the last one, congratulations on making it through the series. I hope you found them valuable. I hope you made notes of them. And I hope then you're implementing what I have told you, how to rectify those situations if you are in those places. Don't be embarrassed if you are. Because if you have gone through some of these deadly, deadly, deadly traps, it's okay. We all go through it. There's a process you have to go through to understand and see how to better get through to the other side. The key is don't stop. 
Like they say, when you're going through hell, don't stop because when you stop, you're staying in hell. And you don't want that to happen, especially in your business. Go make today count and have fun. Mm -hmm.